Hello YouTube, this is Ian559Fresno and today I'm going to teach you how to fix error 1013. This is for like the iPhone 4 or 3GS, whatever, you're trying to update it. And uh, iTunes, it went through like most of the restore and then it came out with error 1013. Your device is stuck in recovery mode, you see a picture of an iTunes logo and USB cable. Very easy to fix, uh, doesn't require any software, anything like that. Um, or if you, this seems too complicated for you, you can always take it to the Apple Store and they'll restore it for you. Um, but it's not really that hard to do and I'll show you step by step. Alright, so first you're going to open up my computer. Uh, so go open up my computer on your computer. Little icon. Looks like that. Once that opens up, go to hard disk drives, whatever hard drive. Might be C, whatever, just click on it and you're gonna see all the stuff next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go into system windows so you're gonna click on windows and you're gonna look for system 32 right here see system 32 and that's gonna open up and now you're gonna look for drivers right here where it says drivers just click on it again to open it and then you're gonna look for etc etc so right here and you see all this now I know some guides like I was doing this and I know some of you guys get confused it says open up hosts and you guys are like oh which one I have two one of them you might see a little icon and right here where it says type it'll say iCalendar file we don't want to open that one we want to open up just the file now here's the thing, like when I was doing this, some guides wouldn't mention, like it, it wouldn't work, it kept telling me I didn't have permission. This is what I'm going to cover, so um, if you're lost at that stuff, then you're in luck. Okay, just, uh, if you're, first you want to do this, go to the host file, right click on it, and then go down and click properties. And you're going to see all of this like stuff, just go to this tab right here, where it says security, and click on it. And you'll see system, administrator, user PC, that's me, Ian. Uh, yours will be something different. What you're going to want to do is you're going to go to users, whatever you're using. You're going to click edit after you click on users. Go back right here. Uh, make sure system is all checked. I'm sure it is. Go to administrators. It should be all checked. And then go to users and click um, check them all. So just click full selected, see full control. When you do that, it'll highlight all of it. If it doesn't, just check them one by one. Make sure everything is check marked as allow. Then just click apply. It'll give you this message. You are about to change whatever. Just read it if you want. Just click yes, and then you're going to click OK. And then you can exit out of here. And you can go back to host. Left click on it twice. Open it in Notepad and then click OK. You're going to see this. Okay, the thing was, mine is just going to look a little different than yours <clears throat> because I fixed my iPhone from before this video. Um, I want to make sure it works perfectly so I don't give you guys messed up directions. <clears throat> You're going to see something like this right here. You see where um, it says number 127 dot whatever gs dot apple gs dot apple you might have one two four whatever go to them and you're gonna delete all of these apple ones don't touch anything else just the apple ones and then delete them then you're gonna go to file at the top left right here click save And it should be saved. Um, before you, you know, go and restore it again, go open it up this time. Open it with WordPad like you did. Make sure it's gone. So it's gone. Uh, and now all you have to do is restore your iPhone again and it will be fixed. Hope you like this video. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Subscribing is free. It'll give you more uh, updates when I post videos. Uh, maybe in the future you'll have a new error. Uh, and 
you you'll have a place to start. Uh, please let me know how if this video worked for you, what you want to see in the future, whatever. Uh, if you will have any like issues, you're stuck with something. Uh, try putting it in the video, but um, don't try to private message because the thing is, I'm sure someone else will have the same issue as you. And if you put it in the video description, uh, the comment section, other people can learn from your problem. Thanks.